my life forces, there isn't a stronger wind style user than me. Yeah, there is. Oh. <laughs> oh. Damn. That would be me. Oh, let's you go. slow, cut. Damn. Yo. Oh. Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to Narrow Warwood. Welcome back to Neverboard. I'm your host, Georgia. My co-host here, Alan, Jason, and today we'll be continuing our series, Neverboard Naruto Ship It In. We've all seen Naruto, but these boys haven't seen Ship It In, so they're gonna get their gender reaction. I'm sure because I love this show overall. Guys, last time we were in Archship, it was crazy. Where we ended off, we saw Itachi break free from Kabuto's control of the reanimation jutsu. It was crazy, guys. We also got to see Naruto debut, enter the battle in his new form, bro. Seeing all those crazy Rasengans coming out, guys. It was crazy to see, but it ends off with everyone doing their separate missions. It, we started off with last week's episode learning about more Gar's backstory, but as we get into this war, guys, it looks like we're going to be refocusing on the main and the juicy stuff on this week's episode. Naruto's in the battle, guys. He's officially in. So, guys, I can't wait for you to see what happens next. So, without further ado, guys, here's our reaction. Naruto shipping episodes 300, 302, skipping the filler, and then going to 321. Hey, guys, I had gold sand. You mean that's fake? <laughs> <laughs> that's Timu. <laughs> that Timu <team> saying? <laughs> What's going on? No! Somebody stop this! I want to be sealed away now! Hey, what the hell? It's entirely out of our control. Our bodies have been programmed to automatically counter an enemy's offensive jutsu. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Oh, oh. My God. Quick, surround them. I have no style. I'm coming this man to lead your soul. Oh, my God, bro. He's tired. Uh. <laughs> Without the Kazutake's help and sensory skills, you'll surely die, Onoki. Onoki's going senile. <laughs> Damn, bruh. Oh, jeez, they're taking L's. Hey! You seriously need to stand back! For real! For real? <laughs> for real. For real? For real? Yes, for real. Now listen, I use shadow style. In other words, that means Genjutsu. And my summoning is a giant clam! Oh. And I'm a lightning style user. Line up your earth style shinobi to use them as a shield and attack with your wind style shinobi. Great, thanks for the intel. Come on! Oh no. All right. Wind and Earth style Shinobi, follow me. Stealing unit, you too. Yes, that's right, Rakage. Go on, get away from here. If you and I stick together, then these guys will never be able to see us. <laughs> so, do you have a strategy, Fifth Kazekage? I'm leaving you in charge here. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> we have to fight him without you? Hey, hey, hold on. What kind of tactic is that? Didn't you hear me? I am a shadow style user. This giant clam can cast a genjutsu over a very wide area. It makes you see illusions. Physical attacks won't work. I can't stand the idea of being manipulated by another jutsu user. That's why I want you to seal me as quickly as possible, Kazekage. Hey! Deal with him. Come back! <laughs> you can count on us. We'll get Dude, what is. Did she see the background? Whiskers? <laughs> kind of funny. Oh, wait, yo! What? <laughs> they call him Whiskers. <laughs> oh, how awkward. Let's get him, guys! Yeah! <laughs> Come on, let's do this! 
Yeah! I'm coming, so show me what you all can do. Let's die. Oh, bro. This is again, you too, bro. Listen up. I'll tell you one more time. Attacking the me you see before you is completely pointless. Your sensory skills are useless against me. You shouldn't underestimate me. Stone clone Jutsu. Oh, shit. So you'll overwhelm me with numbers. That might work. Huh. Oh, bro. Did we get him? No. <laughs> bro. Really? Do you people know how to listen? I told you that attacking this me is completely useless. This me is only a mirage. First, you need to defeat my giant clan. <laughs> it's the one that's been creating the mirage all along. Its shell is hard. Use large-scale weapons or paper bombs. Yes, but... What is it? We used them in our last attack, see? Bro. Uh, me? <laughs> Come on, just hurry up and retrieve all your weapons. Uh, right, sorry. Everyone, quickly. <laughs> what a battle. <laughs> yeah, bro. what's going on, bro? Like, well, the, remember, the music is not really trying to kill him. All right, guys, reset. <laughs> You match. Are you guys call yourself Shinobi? <laughs> I'm sorry that this is taking so long. How awkward. It's a training session? Alright, let's do this, people! Yeah! Target the giant clam! Probably leave the NPCs in charge. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Oh. Wow. Did we? Nah, it's a mirage, I knew it. What? Damn it! I can't stand this anymore! Look, will you listen to me? I keep telling you the same thing. But well, where is the real one? Oh, just like I said, it's hiding somewhere back there behind me, using the mirage as a cover. Damn it! How many times do I have to say it? Attacking this me is useless! Uh, well, actually, I was aiming for the giant clam behind you. I told you! That's just a mirage, you idiot! What the hell? Oh, I am so confused! I don't understand! Wispy whiskers. You're dead. Who <laughs> <laughs> said wispy whiskers, bro? Apologize now. I'm sorry. Oh, how awkward. <laughs> Where'd that come from? <laughs> oh, bro. Behind you, Tsuchikage. No. Oh no. We're back. <laughs> Particle style. Atomic dismantling jutsu. Who's that? Oh. Planet Ross Planet? 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 Oh, look at the Ross Yo! What the? Oh. Lord Mo is a sensory shinobi. Quicksand attack. Don't let your guard down yet. <laughs> I'm still. Nope. <laughs> Way to go, Gara! Oh yeah, and you were pretty awesome back there as well, Shorty Gramps. Shorty Gramps. Shorty Gramps. Chicago, you know. Have respect. What are you doing on the battlefield, Naruto? Why are you here? Uh, well. I got bored. I, uh, <laughs> it's a long story. 
You'd better be able to provide an explanation good enough to persuade me. That's not possible. <laughs> so I'll do the talking. This is Shikaku Nara at HQ. All right, we're all ears, but the fighting's not over. We must head out soon. You can brief us on the way. Dang, bruh. Don't tell me he's gonna escape or something. Well, he said don't let your guard down for something. Oh. It's tall, bruh. I'm really not trying to win against you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everyone, get up! <laughs> He's coaching him. It's a training right? session, dude. <laughs> so that's it. I can't believe even the right card here relented. Very well, I understand. I'll cease transmitting now. Right. Naruto. It's good you're going to each battlefield to identify transformed enemies. But as a former Jinchuriki, I know. The Nine Tails chakra you have. Are you really sure that it's safe to use it so heavily? You know what? I don't plan to die until I become Hokage. Just because you're Kazekage already doesn't mean you can treat me like a kid. Yo! <laughs> I'll take the right battlefront. Damn, go, bro. Grandpa Tsuchikage, you guys go to the left. Naruto, the third right Kage is on that battlefield. Got it! Is the only one that's Why do I bother to keep telling you it's a mirage? Go pick them up. <laughs> You're from the Hidden Mist, aren't you? Aren't you familiar with my jutsu? Sorry, I only know a little about you, Lord Second. I mostly just know about the current fifth Mizukage. Ah, <laughs> the Hidden Mist's obsession with secrecy is to blame for this. <laughs> if I knew things would be like this, I would have left behind a more memorable legacy. What's going on now? Hey, all of you! Huh? Playtime's over! You've got to come at me seriously now! But we have been serious! Playtime's over! Time. <laughs> I have no control over my body. It's casting jutsu all on its own. It's my water balloon jutsu. <laughs> Defend yourselves! <laughs> oh boy. Oh, thank you. Ooh. But damn. I kind of want to know what that would have done. Probably killed him. It's Commander Gara! Yeah, he's back. <laughs> what took you so long? Now, I hope this time you'll be able to seal me. Yes, I intend to. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, no. Commander! <laughs> oh, oh. Oh. They're like water bombs. Don't look elsewhere. Pay attention. Bruh. Seriously. Is that all you've got? <laughs> I've been telling you my weaknesses. You guys are useless. <laughs> yeah, you keep telling us. Oh, he's tired too. Dang. This is more like oil than water. Even if I use sand as a defense, it'll just seep in and collapse it. You tried to stop Mu first, didn't you? You always have to stop the strongest opponent first! That's what winning a battle is all about! We did. <laughs> oh, please, it's obvious that I'm the stronger one! You are strong. Hmm. <laughs> So finally, you understand. Um, hey, what do you mean by appearances can be deceiving? <laughs> You're a wispy one. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Last thing you want. I already told you, I'm not even here. You must find the giant clam quickly and crush it, or this will never end. Ah, yes, you use sand. I simply prefer to let my actions do the talking for me. Oh. Over there. I see. You were already searching for it with your sand. That's why you were distracted and only focused on defense. Well, finally, at last, I get to face a worthy foe. <sighs> I used too much chakra in my battle with Lord Mu. I can't use particle style now. Then I have no choice. I'll just have to smash it to pieces. 
Erstyle Stonefist Jojo! Oh. Just one problem. Oh no. A weak punch like that isn't going to be enough, little Onoki. Put some power into it. You forget that I'm not that little Onoki from long ago that you made fun of. <laughs> Erstyle Super Weighted Boulder Jojo! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> really? Bro. Every time we pop off, his back pops off too. <laughs> well, at least he got a physical therapy. In my heart, I always knew you'd become Suchi Kage one day. But just look at you. You're nothing hmm. more than a stubborn old fool with a bad back. I'll admit that punch had some real power to it, but you overdid it and put yourself out of commission. <laughs> hey, hurry up and escape, would you? This is the Ozuki Clan's water gun, Jutsu. Oh, water. bruh. Water gun? Come on, I can't stop myself. Oh, no. No way. Oh, what? Did that really just happen? Who are you aiming at? What can we do? You're just too fast for our attacks. I'll say it again. I use lightning style. And when I arm myself with lightning style, my speed and defensive power exceed the limits that my body normally puts on them. So unless you attack with wind style, you'll never be able to stop me. Wind unit! Attack formation C! <laughs> Let's go! Instead of doing it quietly, she announces exactly how they're going to attack. Now! Group Ooh. A wide range jutsu designed to overtake my speed. Splendid move. Yes. Now quickly, everyone surround him. What the hell? Times we attack, there's no effect. We haven't inflicted any damage. Naruto gotta step in. Our only choice is to batter him with a consecutive top speed blade dance. <laughs> the hell? That you, Dodai? Yes. He's actually in the flashbacks. The third Lord Baikage was blessed not only with speed and power, but also extraordinary physical resilience. Even long-distance wind-style attacks, the only ones that can reach him cannot deal him a decisive blow. We need a more powerful wind-style user. Well, I'm not a half-bad wind-style user myself, you know. So how did he actually die, anyway? In order to let his people get away, he used himself as a decoy and faced 10,000 of the enemy alone. Oh. It's said that he lasted for three days and three nights to buy his comrades enough time. Holy shit. Damn. Damn. Now I need him to buy me some time, so that at last I can finish up summoning him. I guess I'll take over. Honestly, in the Allied forces, there isn't a stronger Windstyle user than me. Yeah, there is! <laughs> <laughs> Soon. Damn. That would be me. Oh, let's you go. slow, huh? Damn. Yo. Oh. And he got the arms to give him chop. Yo. That feels like wind style jutsu. Is it a newer sangon? It just might work if it hits. Meow. Oh my God. No, that still isn't good enough. Not with this cloak of lightning. Yeah, I know. Raikage are always super fast. <laughs> he's gonna bring it back now. Oh, oh no, he's yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So That's what he was trying to do. Blindside. Oh, oh, he still dodged it. Damn. It's no use. Okay, when it comes back. Oh, he caught that shit. What the? Oh, yo. Yo! Oh. Yo! Windstyle is strong. This could actually work. Ceiling unit, hurry up, move in! Right. 
knockdown baby. Yes. Oh no! Damn, bro. Damn. My lord third, you're so strong that frankly it's frightening. <laughs> oh my goodness. Damn, bro. No way. Rust and Shuriken didn't work. <laughs> It appears that he's been completely taken over. Oh no. What is that? All of you men, move back from Lord Rakage now! And you Earth style Shinobi, get them all up immediately! Everyone, link up! Alright! Together! Earth style Great Mud Wall! Oh man, this ain't good. Yo, yeah, go pick them walls up. With me, Naruto. Oh boy. This don't look too good. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh. Damn. Go. Your third most powerful ninja to the piercing four finger thrust of hell. He pulls lightning chakra into the thousand years of death right here. Compliments lightning style just perfect. Damn. Like Kakashi Sensei's lightning blade. Sasuke's Chidori. Damn, bro. Oh! Everyone, get as far away as possible right now! No way! Since we know where we're gonna come through, we should all focus on that spot. Bruh. Everyone on guard! Stop! Listen to what the clock she know we told you! Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> Yo! What they do what are they Yo, doing? Bro. Are you stupid? Oh my god, bruh. Oh, what an idiot. Oh my. Damn, three fingers. He switched to the three fingered assault. He took down dozens by himself in an instant. The fewer the fingers he uses, the more focused the energy, and thus the thrust of hell gets more powerful. It's the third lord's invincible spear, and he can handle it because his lightning style also makes his body impenetrable. It's his ultimate shield. Damn. Seriously, is that old man even human? It said he's the only shinobi to have gone head to head with a tailed beast unarmored and unarmed. Damn. Wow. Just hands. <laughs> the are nothing short of awesome. Huh? What is it? So, what's up with that? Up with what? Just look. That, there. Scar on his chest. If he's as impenetrable as you say he is, then how'd he get that? He didn't even flinch against my Rasen Shuriken. Oh, that. He was wounded when he stopped Eight Tails, who was on a rampage. Lord Third fought him by himself to protect the cloud. You mean the Eight Tails hurt him? <laughs> he stated that it was the most shameful moment of his life. But other than saying that, he never spoke of it any further at all. I get that ordinary attacks won't affect him. But if he got injured fighting the Eight Tails, then the Eight Tails' strongest jutsu is. Mm. Speaking of eight tails, tail beast bomb. Yo, how do you get that? Damn. Damn, bro. Tail beast bomb. Damn, that's about to. What should we do now, Lady Tamari? I mean, if that hero Naruto couldn't even take him down, what? Naruto's here. The hero of the hidden leaf village? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get a good look at him. You cut, huh? Open your eyes, would you? Naruto's the one who released that fleshy wind style jutsu just now. But how could that be? He's just about the same age as the two of us. Yeah, he's yeah, that's right. He may be young. He might, uh... Oh, bro. Shut up, hell? bro. I don't want to see this. He's an enemy that even the hero of the hidden leaf village can't. What do you think I'm trying to figure out right now? Except I can't. Bro, get these extras out of here. You aren't short range wind style users, so just get back to where it's for real. Thank you. Damn. Bro, how are they? Him side. This is war, bro. Side freaking. How can we fight this Rekage? What do we do? What do we do? Well, bro, Naruto's making a bomb right now. Does Naruto have another jutsu? Woo! Yo! This is a tail of the beast bomb, just like eight tails. I didn't think it was possible for a Jinchuriki in human form to handle such a heavy chakra sphere. 
Oh no. Damn, this one's not good, bro. Oh. Come on, let it out, dude. Oh no. It isn't possible. As I suspected. What happened just now? Damn. Oh it burnt out. Still can't do it yet. His chakra clock has dissipated. He can't do it. Lady Tamari, the enemy's broken through our ranks. Many of our forces were injured. It's to maintain a standby position at a distance. Oh no. No. You alright? Hang on. Hey, Bendy guy. Bendy. I gotta talk to Octopops and the <laughs> tails now. But how can I get in contact with them? I gotta go look for a Comcore Shinobi? You're in luck. Why is that? Because I am a Comcore. Okay. Oh, great. oh yeah. Great. <laughs> Should just say. Watch out! Oh. oh. Maybe not anymore. <laughs> oh, bro. Oh. He's withdrawn his three fingered assault. He's going to just knock us out. Uh. Lava style, rubber sphere. Uh. Hmm? Lord Dodai in the hidden cloud. What do you mean? Naruto wants to talk to Lord B and Eight Tails. Can you arrange that as quickly as possible? While the third Rikage is still chasing after the dummy rubber ball. <laughs> ah! It looked like he had me inside that ball. But he pulled me out and hit me behind a boulder. Bendy guy sure thinks fast. Good old Bane switch. Thanks for that, Bendy guy. Alright, what is his nickname, bro? Bendy guy? Bro, he calls Octopop. Octopop. All these nicknames <laughs> suck, bro. Like... <laughs> Naruto's like, oh, you're Bendy guy? Oh, you're Bendy guy. So don't count on having too much time to converse. Right. You want to talk to B and A Tails? But aren't you with them? You were supposed to be working together. Not right now, we're not. And besides, look, never mind. Please, just get me in touch with them quickly. I don't have any time to waste. <laughs> no. That's a huge stream, dude. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this has gone on ahead. Hurry up and finish your business. It's taking forever. The urge to be is beyond one's control, you see. Hmm? Octopops, it's me, Naruto. There's something I want to ask the Eight Tails directly. Can you switch with them and put them on for me? I've switched places, Naruto. What's going on? You seem to be in a hurry. Hey, Eight Tails, you battled the third Raikage before, right? Yeah, a long time ago. He was really strong and could take some serious punishment. Once, he even chopped off all my tails with his move, the one finger assault. Oh. So how did you manage to give Grandma Raikage that scar on his chest? Huh? Oh, with my tail beast bomb, I think. Maybe, or maybe not. We both collapsed forward, completely spent, yet still poised to attack. I don't remember much beyond that. Oh? Get pranked. Hmm. Will he come back? Could it be? Oh. Thanks, Tails. <laughs> what? This is different than before. Grandpa Raikage is headed here now. I can sense him. You just stay out of the way, Bendy guy. There's something that I want to try out. What's he gonna do? I understand. Rasengan! Wait, what? Everyone! What's that gonna do? Stay out of this fight! And ceiling core stand by! Yes, sir! I don't know what Naruto means to do, but that's an ordinary Rasengan. Is that really going to be enough? Oh! oh. No! Put it to oh, 
I see. Damn. Very smart. He missed. He directed it somewhere. Oh. That's how it happened. Hey, that was good, bro. Damn. Yo, shut up. Damn. Oh Jesus. That was quite a sharp move. When I talked with him, the Eight Tails told me that back when he fought against the Third Reich Kage, both of them fell forward, ready to attack. He must have gotten the scar by stabbing himself in the chest oh. with his own move. That's why he was always so embarrassed about it. <laughs> a shinobi with an invincible spear and an impenetrable shield. It certainly does pose a paradox. I guess this shows that Lord Third's spear is more powerful. Mm -hmm. Damn. Look at Naruto. Mm -hmm. I'd say the shinobi who has the best shield now is probably Gara. Good. All right, Gara versus Naruto. Let's run it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. Gara and Naruto versus someone. All right. Oh no. Oh no, the ox. No. The water gun attack, bro. <sighs> Damn. R. I. P. Onoki. Oh, yeah, shit. <laughs> Damn, that shit look like some. The bullet. No. Hey y'all, thank you guys for staying so engaged with the channel. And you know, I just so appreciate you. When I take the time to answer some of these questions that you brought up to us. And one of the questions you brought up was, who's the best team in Naruto? And to answer this question, guys, we're not gonna be answering like which objectively is the most like powerful person on each team, who is the most power. It's more so that who works best, you know, in, in the team together in teamwork in a teamwork fashion or setting. Because as we've seen throughout the series, Naruto's really hampered on the idea of teamwork. So my question is, guys, you know, if you could pick a team to back you up in a fight, who's going to be the team that you know is going to secure your back, ride or die, no matter what, in, in the situation, right? And to preface this, I'm going to set some ground rules here, right? So it can't, you're not, we can't include Nagato Pain because it's one person controlling six bodies. That doesn't really count as a team. That's him soloing you with six different bodies at the right. same time, right? Right. Um, I, besides that, I mean, Naruto using Shadow Clones doesn't count as a team. So it's going to be two to four, and if you see a bigger teams, let me know. Ikati as a whole can't be counted as a team, but each but each squad in the Ikati can count. So Itachi Kasame, Hidan, and Kakazu, Sasori, Daedara, those teams can count as a team because they were working together to achieve their goals. So guys, my question is, teams in Naruto, up until this point, ride or die, who's the team you got your back in, in a corner situation? Who, who's the guy, who's the, who's the best team? If, if you want, I can answer this question first if you need help, right? There's a lot of good teams on the team. You got Team Guy with Neji, Ten Ten, Rockley, and Guy. A lot of power right there, right? We have the OG Team 7, right? Let's include both variations. Before Sasuke, you include Sasuke in that team. Or after with Sai as well with the Amato. That's a pretty mm. solid team as well, right? I mean, the Legendary Sonic were a notorious team together, too. I mean, we have Inashika Cho, pretty solid damn teamwork. You got members of the Akatsuki, various members. I mean, Itachi Kasami are a great combo. Hidon, the immortal duo of Hidon and Kakusu, pretty mm. solid. They were able to work together towards the end really well, right? Using the immortality for each other. Um, I'm trying to think of another great classic team. I, mean, I, I said Kasami and Itachi. Deidara and Sasori were great teams too, but honestly, you know, you know, if I need someone to make that game shot, I need a team to help me get that across the finish line. For me, it's Ina Shika Cho. Mm. I feel like their teamwork is just a highlight throughout the series as a whole. I wanted to pick the Sand Ceilings. Hell, the Akatsuki are just so powerful. Why doubt them? But in terms of a team that can get me across the finish line, ride or die, I know that whoever's the best teamwork down pat, it's definitely going to be Ina Shika Cho. I mean, it's in their name. They were, They have historically been... They've had this team mentality across multiple family generations in the clan. And I just feel like this iteration too, as you've seen recently with them fighting Zabuza and everything. I'm mean, no, sorry, mm. with them fighting Asu and everything like that, as we saw pretty recently. Once they overcome, you know, their mental breaks, I, they they pretty much are such a solid team. I, I feel like you can't get any better than that. But that's just me. Don't let my answer bias you. But if it is the right answer, I mean, it is what it is. I have no problem with that. But let me know who wants. You know, who do, who's your ideal team you want to have on your side when things go south? There you go. It's up to you. I'm gonna go Team Jiraiya. Oh, uh, with, oh uh, damn. With, oh, with Yahiko, Nagato, and Ko. Damn, I didn't yeah. think of that. That's a good. That's yeah. a good one, bro. That's that's the team I'm going with, bro. I mean, 
we know what they b become later on. Oh, well, I, well, are we are we kind of like including well, well, pretending what we are right now? I mean, any iteration of the team too, because like as you see, some teams change over time. But That's honestly, true. Team Jiraiya is still a good solid yeah. team up because even before they become like down crazy Akatsuki, we they they have some pretty good skills. I would say like right in between, like where we saw those flashbacks. Yeah. That's the team I'm talking about. Okay. Maybe Jiraiya's not there, but no, but Jiraiya's trained them. Trained they haven't them, gone yeah. bad yet. Yeah, yeah. I it's like you. that Akatsuki. They're like they're, the, they're in the Akatsuki, but they haven't gone to become the Akatsuki right. yet. Yeah, that right, group right. right there, I think, is a solid group because you know Nagato he. If if things are getting pushed to shove or getting really bad, you got you right, know, right, right yeah, on. ghetto statue. <laughs> ghetto statue out of nowhere. But other than that, like they all have amazing abilities. Yeah. And I don't know, bro. Like I feel like if we're gonna have, if I'm going to battle, that's the team that I want behind me. Fuck, that's not, a that's a good one, bro. Yeah, Shit. I that's told you, bro. I, I had to look at it because I was like, dude, there's a lot of teams. I was either gonna pick that or Team Seven. Or, or, which version of Team 7 with Yamato and Sai or before with Sasuke and Kakashi? Nah, I'm gonna do Yamato Sai. Yeah. Yeah. And then I also had another one. This one was kind of iffy one, but Team Minato. Oh, OG Team yeah, Minato. OG with, Team okay, Minato, by yeah. the end before Obito, you know, you know, bites the you know, bites the dust. Like, yeah, they were a pretty solid team together. So. It just depends on who who we're battling. That's the real question. Yeah. If you're battling like if you're around regular sh regular shinobis, then it, I would I would mind Team Minato. Any team would be fun. Team Seven. Yeah. But like, if I'm going like hardcore people, I'm going with Team uh, Team Jiraiya, bro. Okay, that's a, that's a solid pick, Alan, bro. It's up to you, dog. Like, okay. So she could show Team Jiraiya, a solid pick. But what about you, okay. bro? Okay. I had I have two answers. Team Orochimaru. <laughs> no, no, no. Um. So before you said. Uh, she could uh you know, she could show you know she could show right that was gonna be mine i was okay. like that's very safe you, you could you could keep that i mean but i'm gonna go with the legendary sonin oh, okay okay before Ochimaru, you know turn back but okay, like okay okay i come on it's jiraiya Orochimaru, and sonate true yeah. come you got, on you got the healer you know you got jiraiya good good vanguard and Orochimaru is always snaking around the legendary sonin like, i mean if, to get a name True. From oh, yeah, the Hanzo did name them, and Hanzo named them out of respect, not because they were pussies. So that's, that's if Orochimar didn't go bad, that's that's pretty crazy. Like that's true, and you have all three of them bring their summonings out. Yeah, that Fuck. look how are they about to die against Hanzo? Yeah, yeah, but Obito did die. So like, <laughs> if you're going Team Minato, okay, who's your other team you picked? Well, no, my team was Team Jiraiya. I'm was sorry, like, Team yeah. Jiraiya. Dude, actually, no, I you're right. Jiraiya on actually, my team. <laughs> That's your team. But his has the Rinnegan. Yeah. That's bro. the problem, bro. His team got the Rinnegan. I have their Sensei. Yeah, yeah but, but the, the Sensei didn't teach him the Rinnegan. And dude. the funny well, thing yeah, is, I told Merc Jiraiya later anyway. Yeah, oh yeah, he killed him. That was him. betrayal. Oh. That was betrayal. Nah, bro. I mean, right, bro. Is, I mean, oh, okay, is it betrayal? Okay, well... Still, Dude, uh, it, wasn't it, was, it was it was fighting. Fighting. They were fighting. Yeah, it wasn't a betrayal. Like you stabbed me in the back. It was like yeah, were we're fighting. gonna fight. I'm gonna kill you guys. You had to use the freaking uh, Poe and to freaking po Ma and Toad or whatever. Ma and Pa Toad. Oh, fuck. Po and Toad. Sorry. Dude, <laughs> all them. Okay. I don't know, but that's the thing though. Like here's the thing. Jiraiya is a sneaky fuck. So even if you kill him, is he really dead? I mean, Jiraiya. I'm sorry, Orochimaru. 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 Yeah. I mean, but this is before the curse mark stuff, right? Kinda, yeah, but but he he was gonna do that before he technically turned bad. But like, look how powerful he is. Like, to yeah. be okay, to, uh, dude. To be okay at that point. Okay. Wait, 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 Jason. Nagato dead. Yahiko dead. Kona dead. Sonate's last time we saw still alive. For Sonate's feats, you still are there to where like she yeah, she was able true. to heal the village even when Pain killed everyone. She's able she to could. heal herself. True, she's able to heal herself and heal other people in your death. Orochimaru got the summoning and his snake jutsu on his side. And remember, his hand isn't sealed away. So, okay, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, let's not forget who brought back the whole leaf village. Yeah, but that's, that's ah, literally the pain. That's not that's not Nagato. That's the pain. That's it, the pain. Is, it, is it? How is it? Bro, he's the one that was in the thing, like, that did the last jutsu to bring him and, back. And to be fair, like... Nagato having the Renegon to this point. Okay, to be fair, like, yeah, it's a tough one, bro. It's kind of a tough one. The I mean, the that, whole point of the dude, Renegon was to bring Madara back. Yeah, True. but he used it to bring back the whole village. Well, that's because of uh, Naruto. So, technically, Sonata couldn't do shit. Uh, Jiraiya's dead. Dude, they're all uh, dead. Your whole team is dead. Yeah, but, but because if it wasn't for our sacrifice, you wouldn't have the, any of the people. Like, your Sonata wouldn't even have a village. I mean, that's only because of Naruto. 
Not big as a Nagato. And yeah, but Nagato's the one that did the ability. Not, well, that's because not he just Naruto. has the Renegon. That's it. Like, true, true. What happens if you didn't have the Renegon? I mean, you wouldn't have pain I mean, or anything like that. Yeah, okay, that, okay. Anything. in terms of what is... Okay, but the, the question is not who's gonna, which team would overcome each other. My question is who's the best teamwork overall and both of I just want to spice it up honestly you, you, you did a good job spice it up, I mean the best you got him feeling we got us feel some type of way I mean the best you did good dog I'll tell you this bro I mean the best team team group dynamic is uh you know true Chico. but the thing yeah. is it's like you can have good dynamic but shit but if fucking you get almighty push I mean on, I mean all dryer is like oh Sonata let me let me cop a feel that's I mean I mean to be fair oh, well remember when they're all fighting each other together against each other in part one remember Jiraiya was still holding up his own up until Orochimaru poisoned him to be fair hands were gone sure but that's a good point and to be fair also I, I mean I'm not trying to shit on your thing but even do you remember when <laughs> do you remember when Orochimaru tried to merge Jiraiya because he was injured during their whole like who's gonna, my question is of their team dynamic who's gonna be the one to be the biggest i never snake? no i literally said like i never said that their dynamic is good they're powerful but their dynamic isn't good true before like you know orochimaru went bad but at least jirai and sonate would have each other's back well that's the thing right so we're picking a team that would have our back and help us in battle right that's yeah, who, that would, the who, who, who would you have yeah who would be the team I, again i again it could be the strongest team but i emphasize on the team part not so much the strongest right, because right, right, right. if you're going by oh team seven technically okay naruto as is could stomp a pretty All much of a, yeah, 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 yeah like so like technically just, he's the i mean then team the, but that doesn't mean the like, best team, team dynamic is always you know she could show like they actually have each other's back all but the you brought up a good point about being la named the legendary signing and they've still had that point however they have a good team dynamic to the point. Hey, actually, they're... hold on, hold on, hold on. Orochimaru, when he saw your team back in the day, he was like, oh, let's just kill them right now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> wait, wait, that's that's it. True. I mean, and the only reason why is Jirai was like, wait, bro, I got it. Let me help take care of them. And the funny thing is, if you're going by counts, Orochimaru was like, damn, I, his decision <laughs> technically could have been right at the end because pain ends up coming back killing. <laughs> That's true. Shit, shit. Alan came with damn. Y'all both came with receipts today. I mean, I like dude, it. you're right. He, you're just, the student killed your eye. No, <laughs> Jamar could have killed that. It's like a yeah. back and forth. Yeah. But with teamwork ability, it's I think it's Unishi could show. Like they, I, I think I, I picked this again. I picked a safe one because again they had their team okay. against like. But if I were to pick like on, um, okay, then let's spice up the question. Then if I were to pick then a more on. You want to pick like the worst team? <laughs> no, honestly, if I were picking like a team with stop ability, like mm. pain is pain with Conan is still up there. But honestly, if Itachi was somewhat healthy, like bro, he just has to stare at people and then just. And Kisame could just suck up or kill them after the fact too. But in terms of team dynamic, I pick Inishika Cho just because again, clan lineage history and their fight against their multiple fights against Hidon and Kakazu. Dude, Funny. I know the best team, bro. It's uh, uh Kona Hamaru. Um, oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm about to kill myself, bro. <laughs> nah, homie. The new age kids. Don't give me, the... don't give me them kids. <laughs> the best. Just because you can do the, what the the the, the Rasengan? Rasengan? Nah, get that shit out of here, bro. Bro, kills one pain and all of a sudden best team ever. Yeah, nah, homie, nah. Oh, my. He, keep That'll me away. The worst team. That's my a title. No, my best team is Kakashi's Dog Squad when he summons them. <laughs> oh my, my god. Hakun's like sounding like a New York cigarette smoke. I mean, you could say uh, that Kakashi's team wasn't. Minato's team was probably not that great. I mean, two of them are dead. Yeah, but again, in the context of that, two. they were pretty good teamwork. Where like, when Kaka again, like they trained together as a team. Kakashi and you know Obito with butt heads. But when they were, you know, once Obito unlocked his you know Sharingan and Kakashi lost his eye, right, his original eye, they fought that sand that uh, Stone Shinobi. And they beat him up until he's like, I'm just gonna collapse this. I cave, mean, but. Loki though. Ren was kind of like an NPC character. We really didn't Dude, see. I, yeah, she, yeah, she, 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 she only heals. She heals. She yeah, she so. like, at least Sakura, she, she, she's a healer, but she at least does. She stuff. has power. Yeah. And Ren, all she did was just stand there, and then Obito and Kakashi are like trying to like you know. Yeah, and she did get caught too yeah. during the end. So yeah, in terms of a team, it, okay, if Minato put in more legwork in that team, like he probably that'd be a yeah, solid it'd be a different team. It'd be a different Sensei, team. Bro, yeah. Bro, bro. yeah. Well, I guess we'll find out why. <laughs> who was uh, who, who was Minato's uh, sensei? No, well I know it was um Jiraiya. Yeah, but who was his uh other... his teammates? Yeah, we'll never. I guess we'll never find out. That's bullshit. <laughs> we'll okay, find out. we probably will find That's out. Something to find out. Okay, I'll tell you this though, guys. Actually, there was a Minato manga, one shot manga, about fifty pages that came out recently, and it shows the backstory about how he created the Rasengan and stuff. Mm. I don't ever animate it, but if they ever do, I will definitely show it to you guys. It's a very cool manga. But I'm not gonna say anything because it kind of like, 
it, it kind of comes in what you're talking about, so I don't want to say anything about that. But let's just say that, you know, you may get an answer one day in the very far, distant far, future. far distant future. Hmm. Okay. But, um, or I can send you the link to the manga. It's pretty cool. Oh, so. it's I'll send it to you guys. I'll link it. Is in it want to be a spoiler? Not as it's it's a, a past stuff. It's I mean, something in the past, so I think you'll be okay to you know like read that. If I send it to you guys, it's a cool manga. It's a good read, or we can read it together on the channel if you guys want to do it one day. So we'll do that. Sorry, I was what? pretending like we're in like in school doing like a, a <laughs> teacher's reading a book and everyone's <laughs> sitting on the floor. <laughs> I opened the book. So on this corner of the page today, there's Naruto and his dad. <laughs> so you guys, we we got to talk a lot about about the different aspects of the teams. Uh, we talked about our preferred team, so I guess I kind of ended off. Would be an underrated team, you guys. You were thinking about just an underrated team as a whole. Because for me, I thought that the new version of Team Seven is Team Seven being with Sai mm. Yamato and them. I think they're a pretty good team as a whole. It was underrated team. Like that's how actually who, who was going to be my second choice. So oh I'd really? Probably, yeah, that's what I would have. I would probably pick them. Yeah, but honestly, Jason, your team Jiraiya one came out out of nowhere, and I think that's a good one too. But. Uh, for me, as an underrated team, because yeah. damn, I didn't even think about that shit. Imagine fucking calling out those little shurikens at you. Nagato Almighty pushes that shit. That'd be bullets. <laughs> 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 That's cool. Sound Ninja Four. Actually, they're not bad of a team. Actually, they were the ones that helped or Orochimaru sue the barrier so Orochimaru could kill the third. And they are the ones that were sent no. to get Sasuke. Actually, ooh. no. I already know. You we both were probably it's, the, it's the hawk. Oh, Taka? Taka. Oh! Yeah. Damn, I forgot they were yeah. a team, too. But, but they went up, and they went up against I Killer mean, B. They, they're they strong, but, like, Sasuke is kind of a douchebag. He kind of does his own thing Yeah, still. and then he gets everyone else. Yeah, like, towards the end, but remember, when they fought Killer B, they all worked in tandem together, so. Well, yeah, but, but, I mean, Sasuke literally was like, oh. I mean, they beat Killer B, and, I mean, Sasuke did have to bring out more abilities, but it's because That's of true. teamwork. Him seeing his team about to get marked, that he was like, I'm going to fucking show my back. I mean, he literally Fuck, um, that's like, that's didn't like, mind, uh... Damn, my car ain't getting killed, so... Towards the end, yes. Sure. Is true. is uh, is there, like, a team name for Orochimaru, Sasuke, and uh, Kabuto? Yeah, the the pedophilia team. Okay. Oh, team, wow. Uh, team science. No, I'm kidding. No. Team um, science. Team, science. <laughs> team, team, let me take your body. <laughs> team body snatch. Team curse mark? Team, cur I, uh, team Orochimaru. <laughs> oh, who was Orochimaru's student? Uh, it was... Uh, Anko. But and then... Who uh, were the other two? Was there other... Uh, random one and two. Oh, did Anko have students? Uh, yeah, she did. Kind of. Fuck, man. Like, she, she proctored yeah, she the did. She did. Oh, she proctored the tuning exam. I just, I saw her team actually on here. Team Anko? No, isn't this? Oh, no, 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 sorry, no, that's no, Kuro and I. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she didn't really have yeah. a team. She, she, Who's she Kuro and I's students again? Uh, it's Hinata. Uh, Kiba and uh, oh, because it's kind of funny in Shippen they just never mention like like everyone has their feelings towards their uh, their sensei like you know uh, you know she could show they 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 love their sensei yeah. you know all everyone like but then they're like oh they don't Bro, but Kurenai gets knocked up in between like Naruto and Shippen so okay. she just ends up becoming pregnant and her hubby dies yeah that's pretty so, much what happens you say? to her her hubby dies oh I was yeah. like, you said probably dies I was like damn uh, I mean well Asuma did die so. No, I thought you were just talking about Kuro and I was like, whoa. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, Asuma. Okay, that's it. Pretty talk is a group. Wasn't Guy, answer. I mean, wasn't Guy, Kuro and I, and Asuma in a group? Or is that, am I? No, that might have been like a flashback or something, but I don't think so. Another good is um, Inoshiki Cho is like their dads. Yeah, they, they the OGs, they the were OGs, pretty good. Yeah. yeah, they're pretty good as a team too. So, And we did see them fight together during the uh, Konoha, or the Leaf Village getting crushed during the... Uh, part one of naruto and then mm. so the sound village came so in the sand so yeah that's a pretty good team too taco was a great answer yeah og you know she could show good answer too um, that's really all i got I yeah remember. i think that's a the taco being taco or heavy is a good team Actually, okay taco is when they find out about the truth about itachi heavy is when before then so mm. had, but still that team that's a that's a solid team lineup for sure so definitely yeah. I, I would definitely agree with that that's a good one so guys let us know your thoughts on you know what is your favorite team in naruto give us your thoughts on who would you have backing up in a life for the situation also who would be an underrated team that doesn't get enough appreciation in the series these guys gave you guys had gave great answers for this question today i really appreciate you guys bringing different mindsets and argument and the spice 
like loving it when it gets spiced up and heated up a little bit, you know. But guys, you guys have any more final thoughts on the question? Nope. So guys, we'll wrap up our question here. Guys, thank you guys once again watching our reaction as well as our discussion for this week's episode, as well as our thoughts on this discussion. Please video like, subscribe, do all the things. You know, keep commenting below. We love commenting on the stuff you guys bring for us. I'm your host, my co-host here. Alan. Jason. Y'all have a good one. Peace. Hey, what do you think you're doing? If you can't trust me, then I'll just take my own life right here and right now. But please, just save my husband! Hey, stop that! Come on. No, what if they're enemies? And what if they're actually comrades? I have to tend to that man's injuries. Oh, thank you. Sakura! <laughs> Sakura!